Hey, what's good, everybody? It's your boy Onyx here, Gone Full Nerd. And what I plan on doing today is checking out not so much coffee, but checking out some toffee. Oh, toffee, you say? Well, I'm going to do a little nice little check out because what would you do? Woo woo! Woo woo! Woo woo! Woo woo! <laughs> do you woo woo woo? Uh, anyway, what would you do for a Klondike bar? Especially, let's get a little, let's get a little focus here. Let's get a focus. Uh, Heath Klondike bar. So, your boy, I've never really been big on Klondike bars with the chocolate over the vanilla ice cream, but I did check out they got different flavors and varieties and all that good stuff of Klondike bars. So I decided to snatch up the Heath flavor. The Heath flavored toffee, not coffee, but toffee Klondike bar and let y'all see what's going on. Now, I ain't gonna lie, this is wrapped kind of funky. I got it out of multi-pack and then I opened it, I look at it. You know, it was sealed, it is nothing, no tamper, but that's kind of a funky wrap job there. I haven't even unopened it, I just grabbed it out the pack and came straight to the camera. But we're going to see how the Klondike bar, how the Klondike, the Heath toffee flavor Klondike bar look. Now, I ain't going to lie, I mean it came straight from the grocer's freezer to my house, so I didn't give it a chance to melt because I live like right across the street from the grocery store. I'm going to say, you know, I unwrap it. It looking kind of nappy. Hold on, let me drop. Can't be dropping stuff all in my in my crib. Okay, it's a little nappy looking. It looks like it got a little refreeze thing going, but it looks all right. I mean, it looks like a typical Klondike. Not big on the Heath toffee stuff because you can peep it. It's not a lot, and it's kind of melting. That's crazy. I mean, literally, I took it, I mean, maybe about 15 minutes top. So, yeah, it's not too bad, but let's see. Mm. Now, I'm going to say, while this is delicious, and of itself as a Klondike bar, as an ice cream treat, this is going to get a four. I'm going to tell you that now. Mm. But, The reason I'm going to give it a four is because I really don't taste the Heath bar of it. I mean, I taste the chocolate. I mean, I see the little toffee pieces in it, but it's not, you know, I figured it would taste like exactly like a Heath bar on the crunchy outside. But, you know, really it tastes just like a regular Klondike bar. So, Luckily, they charge the same for all of them. It's just pretty much, huh? Mm. But solid, nothing to write completely home about. So, what would I do for a Klondike bar? Well, what I need to do is go get me a damn napkin because it's not good. They melt quick as all get out. And it doesn't help. I got the camera lights and all this other good stuff. But good little frozen treat. Nice little day. Your boy here, Onyx. You know, your boy Onyx here, going full nerd. I give the Klondike Heath Bar a four. And the only reason it gets a four is because Klondike bars, I like Klondike bars. They're going to get a four right off the bat. It wasn't going to get a five because I really don't taste the Heath Bar on it. So really, basically, what they did is they branded it. Put a little bit of heat, you know, a little bit of heat toffee on the joint, and then they roll with it. I mean, good. I mean, but if you're looking to get that heat flavor, don't do it. I mean, it just looks like regular thin milk chocolate coating. Now, I'm actually going to finish this on screen, so. Because I'm not trying to make a big mess, but not bad. Klondike, you all right. You all right. I ain't going to do much. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. But this is your boy Onyx going for another ice cream in and out. I will see you guys next week with another treat, coffee, frozen treat, something. Obviously, the toffee rhyme with coffee didn't really work out for us this week, but hey, we'll do it. Subscribe and uh, check me out on Periscope every morning for coffee time with your favorite nerd. Peace. I'm out. Mmm. Mm-hmm.